Many people ask the profit of e-waste PCB recycling. It cannot be generalized as there are many types of PCB. The metals contained in PCB include basic metals, such as aluminum, copper, iron, nickel, lead, tin and zinc, etc. And precious metals and rare metals, such as gold, silver, palladium, rhodium, selenium, etc. Of which copper content is relatively high. The composition and content of elements in the PCB of different electronic devices are different. For example, the precious metal content of the PCB in the TV is less than that of the computer, and the content of iron, lead and nickel is more. The main components of computer motherboards are resins and glass fibers, plastics, copper, iron, alloys, etc. If you only recycle the metal copper in the PCB, you can buy waste PCB with inferior quality. If you want to recycle the precious metal in the PCB and extract the precious metals, you must buy the PCB with better quality. Then, what are the uses of metals and non-metals separated by PCB recycling machine? For metals, high-purity metals can be sold directly. You can also further sort all kinds of precious metals. And the economic benefits are very considerable. Non-metals extracted from waste PCB can be used as additives and filling materials and can be used to make non-burning cement bricks colored tiles, water pipes, WPC plates and other building filling materials. After modification, non-metallic powder can be used as filler in modified asphalt, plastic and rubber industries. Now you have a basic understanding of e-waste PCB recycling. If you want to know more about this project, please do not hesitate to get in touch with us directly.